Hi guys, um, I am back with another video, so anyway, let's get on to the video. So today, I um, decided I wanted to do something really fun, so I have most of my makeup done. I'm going to be focusing on my eyebrows today. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> I am disgusting. <laughs> but um, I wanted to bring, or try to do this today. But um, uh, this is one of the Instagram um, makeup artists that I follow, and it is um, Bretman Rock. He's actually absolutely beautiful. Um, he does the best makeup tutorials. He's always looking so freaking bomb. But he did um, these. Can't really see it, but they're like really they're beautiful like these sparkly brows that are just giant like his brows are so beautiful but they're just super sparkly and like super mesmerizing and I just want to do them so we're gonna try to try like I'm gonna try to do this today I don't know how well I'm gonna succeed so um yeah so I'm just gonna jump right into it I already mostly have my brows filled in like they messily filled in with my um with a NYX brows pencil in like some shade, I don't know. I don't know, I have no idea. And so I'm just gonna scoot my mirror just a little bit forward so I can see my face. And let's just get started. Um, I think first I'm gonna do is fill them in just a little bit more so, so that they're not as patchy as they really are. Like you can't really tell on the camera because it's not super great quality, but yeah. So I'm just gonna fill in and I'm just gonna do a, a light um, one and it's this is the NYX Tame and Frame Brow Pomade and it's in the shade Blonde and so I'm just going to take that and I'm going to take my Milani brow pencil it's got a spoolie and then like a super awesome sharp brow jigger on my other hand I'm just going to dip into that I'm dip it and I'm gonna start just filling in my brows. So I think I have my brows as filled in as I want them to be. I'll just put my spoolie and just gonna gently come through them. Um, next, <coughs> I need to look at the picture again. Excuse me. <coughs> I feel like I'm losing my voice. Um, you can still definitely see the darkness in his brows, so I was going to use concealer to fill them in, but I don't think I'll do that. I think I'll just, um, start with the sparkles again. Oh, shoot. I forgot one thing. I'm going to burn it real quick. Hmm. So I have this, um, NYX Studio Liquid Liner in extreme gold um i think i'll add these to my brows and i'll just quickly swipe it over just to start the dramatic effect so here are my eyebrows one minute so far, maybe I'll bring my eye up. So they're very, very shiny already. Um, <sighs> next in this lovely process, I think we shall take a very glittery color. Yeah, I'll take this one first. I'm gonna take my peanut butter palette and I'm gonna take bananas out of that. It's very, it's a very gold color so we'll start packing that onto the eyebrows and then I'm gonna take another eyeshadow and this one is gator wings from my swamp palette it is the highlight in it and it's got um, glitter to it so um, I will also just really pack that on 
just want these eyebrows to shine and just glitter. Boom, yeah. Um, so I think for the last thing that I'll do to really get the sparkle in my eyebrows that I want to achieve Um, yeah, I will add this glitter. It is from Wet n Wild. It is one of their color icon glitter shadow things in brass. Um, they are very, like, Vaseline-y, but they have a lot of glitter to them, so. I mean, like, look at that glitter. Lots of glitter, so I'll just pack that. Now, on to my eyebrows. Ha! Oh my gosh, I love it. So then I'm just gonna take a spooling brush and um, spool you through them. Just kidding, because they are glued down. All right. So I, that is the finished product. Took me a freaking long time. So, um, let me Right up here. This is the finished product of my brows. They are very shiny, very sparkly. Um, in his photo, he had a lot bigger eyelashes to really um combat, I guess, the eyebrows because the eyebrows just like stick out. But um, I don't, I didn't go pick up any bigger eyelashes than I already had. Um, but maybe to help mine, I'm going to do a dark lipstick, a vampy lipstick. Um, the one I'm going to be using is from Bite Cosmetics, and I'm using the, and it's a double-sided lipstick, so I'm going to use the scarlet side. It is very dark and very vampy, and then I'm going to use the Jordana Lip Easy Liner for Lips in Plush Plum to help myself. So I don't overline or go crazy and draw over my face. So yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and wipe any excess um, mask from my lips. I do like to either put on a very heavy lip balm or I have a mask that I put on my lips before I put any like sort of lipstick or any liquid lipstick on my lips. Okay, I got that all filled in with my lip liner, and I filled in my lips fully so that I can, so the lipstick will stay in place because it is just a regular lipstick, and I don't need it everywhere. So now I'm just going to take that and just fill my lips in. And voila. So, um... I kind of look alien right now, but that's okay. Um, this is the finished look. So yeah, um, it's a very different look. Honestly, I think I would wear it every single day. Just kidding, no I won't. No, this is just like a fun look that I wanted to try out just to see if I could do get the eyebrows like how I wanted. And I, I think I did pretty okay. So yeah, um, not a look I would wear every day. I don't know. I don't like how they. I don't like how they feel right now. Like, <laughs> they feel very like. <laughs> and yeah, <laughs> but it's interesting. It'd be a fun Halloween look. Something fun to add to Halloween. I don't know. Just something different that I wanted to try out. So I hope you guys loved it. Um. If you guys have any suggestions or anything that you'd like to see, go ahead and leave them below or hit me up anywhere in the DMs. I don't care. But yeah, um, so I hope you love this tutorial and I'll see y'all next time. Bye!